Let's switch people. Watch each other a few times. <laughs> Watch the head. Like a very straight stuff, like for my uh, rugged shock here. Like this one. And then, like you're retreating and then doing it that <laughs> Bring it above in front of you, like vertically, then slide your hand down. Because if we both just um, kept our sticks here, and he were, went to reach out to like hit me in the arm and just kept her hands on it without sliding, now we're at the same length. But if he slides it, so just do that, look at that. Yeah. <laughs> Can't get him, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so. Using the sliding of the stick makes a huge difference to start to aim and do all sorts of different places you can hit with. So he picks it up, slides his hands down, and gets that feeling of it going through his body. Then you alternate sides so you can switch to the other side, from the other side, and you can create kind of a flow with it. Nice. Okay, so try that like this and kind of like break it up into little thirds so you hold your hands like that. Then I can go. Ooh, I like that one. Right? And I can like pick this up and hit. Then I can flip that in and hit. Then I can go to the end and hit. And there's a lot of different ways that you can start to make this thing happen. So go slow so you don't bash your knuckles with your partner. Yeah. Clink, clink. Maybe not hit as hard. Your opponent holds their staff like or their hombo like this. Then I can go and I can take a step out to the side and I can generate a lot of power with twisting my hips and my spine falls through and this kind of comes in and does this pretty fast, amazing hit. So see if you can generate some power. But you don't want to just use your arm, you want to move your body through the hip with it. Difference. Power. Power. It, it feels like balance. More, yeah, more, more balance weight. like this. A little more weight on the end, like this, than like this. It's interesting. Figure out. So this is better. Yeah, yeah. that would pretty much be death. Uh, your partner's <laughs> gonna hold their combo up like this, out to the side of them, and you're gonna be in Munendo. So you flip this up, and you come through and. Of a straight forward poke. What I'm doing is I pick it up, put it in the front hand, and I slip my back hand around so it's easy to come through like that. But see if you can do it without watching the Hanbo itself. You can use your peripheral vision to hit it. Because then you can watch other things going on, or you can go wide angle. Left hand, back hand. Okay. okay, once you're you're good at that, and then have the person hold it up, and then close your eyes and see if you can vibe out where it went to. Oops, I'm not to it. So see if you can vibe out where it is, and then if you miss, take a look and go, oh, I'm feel it out more. Mm.